Okay, now let me show you some magic. I've got this Windows PC here running on Windows 11. Let me open the browser and open a web page here. Now what I'm going to do is, I'm going to copy this paragraph on this article. Now let me take out the Samsung Galaxy phone. I will open Samsung Notes. Create a new note. The keyboard is open here. All the content that I copied on this PC is available right here on this keyboard. I just tap on this to paste it on this note. What do you think about that? Just copy the content you want on the PC and paste it right here on the phone instantly within a second. That is a crazy feature, isn't it? I'm sure you're curious to know how exactly did I do this. In this video, I'm going to show you exactly that. Before we go ahead, if you love the content of the channel, be sure to subscribe and become a part of Apex community to watch some useful contents like this and smash the like button if you find any value in these contents. Now, let's go ahead. Now, this is basically syncing the clipboard history between the Windows devices and Microsoft Swift Key keyboard. Yes, you need Microsoft Swift Key keyboard on your Galaxy phone or any Android phone to enable this fantastic feature. Just go to Google Play Store, search for Microsoft Swift Key keyboard. I've also left a link for this application in the video description. You can go ahead and click on that link as well. Just install this application and follow the instructions to add the keyboard on your phone. Once you've done that, the Swift keyboard will be active. Now open any application like messaging app or Samsung Notes. Just open this keyboard and on the toolbar, you will see this icon clipboard. Just tap on this. Here you may see a notification to enable syncing feature. If you don't see that, just tap on manage. Here, as you can see, we have got an option sync clipboard history. It says copy and paste text from your other Windows devices. When this is on, Microsoft receives your clipboard data to sync across your Windows devices. Tap on enable. Now here you will have to log into the same Microsoft account which you have used on your PC as well. Make sure you have logged in with the same account. Once it's done, this feature has been enabled and we are good to go. Now whatever you copy on the Windows PC or any other Windows devices, the copied content will be offered on the Microsoft Swift Key keyboard as well. It is going to sync the data and offer it on the clipboard. And the best part is it happens in a jiffy. Let me show you how seamlessly this works. Let's tap on clipboard again. As you can see, it says syncing is on. And here, all the contents that I've copied on the PC are available right here. Again, let me just copy something on the system. As you can see, it is instantly appearing it right here on the clipboard. Unfortunately, we don't have an option to copy an image. However, we can copy an image link which will get synced to the clipboard. As you can see, I will just copy an image on the web page. The link is available right here on the keyboard. I can paste it on any browser app on the phone to open that link or open that image. Basically, we will have to copy the image link itself so that it can appear on the keyboard here. We can sync the contents not only from the browser, but also from MS Word, any notes app or any other application you have, the copied contents will sync up with Microsoft's fifth key keyboard. This is indeed an incredible feature we have here. Let me know what do you think about it, whether it will be useful for you, drop a comment. I will be making a few more videos on the usability of this Microsoft Swift key. And I'll also post a comparison video comparing the Samsung keyboard and Microsoft Swift key keyboard. If you're interested, drop a comment and let me know. That's about it. Thanks for watching. My name is Sally. I'm signing off. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye.